Guesty's Rate Plans feature allows you to create and manage all your Booking.com rate plans from one place. A rate plan is a combination of prices, cancellation policies, and meal options. And by offering multiple rate plans, you can attract a wider variety of guests and increase your average income per reservation. For example, some guests prefer to book early and get the lowest price, while others will pay a bit more to keep their plans flexible. A rate plan is applied to a group of listings that have the same pricing strategy. For example, a group of high-end listings in San Francisco will fall under the same pricing strategy. Each rate plan you set up is based on a guestee listing's standard rate, which is the price visible on the listing's calendar, along with the number of minimum nights. This video will help you get the rate plans feature set up for the first time. Click Revenue Management in the top menu, select Rate Plans, and hit Get Started to go ahead and create the very first rate plan. You can create your own customized rate plan from scratch, or choose one from one of Guesty's predefined rate plans, which can also be customized. In this example, we'll create a new custom rate plan. Start by choosing your rate plan's cancellation policy. In this example, we'll choose moderate, with a 50% cancellation fee. This means that if guests cancel reservations up to 7 days before check-in, they'll be charged 50% of the total price. If canceled within 7 days prior to check-in, they'll be charged the reservation's full price. Choose whether or not meals are included in the rate, and enter an alternative number of minimum nights required to make a reservation, if relevant. Use this in such cases as providing longer-term stays, for example, or when offering a highly flexible cancellation policy that would require a certain number of minimum nights to qualify. Otherwise, it's best not to set this here, and the number of minimum nights on each listing's calendar will be used instead. Now let's talk about availability. If relevant, the rate plan can come into effect for a specific date range. For example, over the Christmas and New Year period, apply a super strict cancellation policy, which would be non-refundable. You can even specify certain days of the week within that date range that the rate plan should or should not take effect. Note that rate plans will also not be applied to dates on the calendar that are already blocked, whether that's due to a reservation or a block was added manually. With advance notice, choose how many days before a check-in date the rate plan will be applied until. Let's say that this rate plan will be applied up to three days before a check-in date. Booking window lets you choose how far into the future guests can make reservations under this particular rate plan. In this case, let's say that this rate plan will apply if a guest wants to book within the next three months. The section below lets you choose which channels the rate plans should sync with. Rate plans currently only sync with Booking.com, but we'll be adding support for more channels in the future. Next up, we'll set the pricing adjustment. Here you'll choose whether you'd like to increase or decrease the standard rate by a certain amount or a certain percentage. In this example, we're offering a rate with moderate cancellation terms, which gives guests less flexibility than free cancellation, so we'll decrease the standard rate by 10%. All that's left is to give your plan a name and description. Note that this information is only displayed within Guesty and is not viewable by guests on the Booking Channels platform. Now let's choose which groups of listings the rate plan applies to. Groups of listings are created by assigning each listing to what's called a rate strategy. If you haven't set any of these up yet, no worries, you can learn how to do so in our Help Center by clicking on the question mark on the bottom right corner of your screen, searching for Rate Strategy, and opening up these articles. Let's click Save and Assign to continue. Select the relevant groups of listings like this, and click Apply. Keep in mind when creating your first rate plan in Guesty for these particular listings, Existing rate plans in Booking.com that are not managed by Guesty will be deactivated. You can then go ahead and remove these in your Booking.com account. A rate plan that has been created in Guesty will contain Guesty in its title, so you can easily differentiate between them. Select I understand the implications and hit continue. All rate plans for these listings should now be managed in Guesty. The rate plan will appear here. You can add or remove assigned groups of listings at any time by clicking here. To remove groups of listings, click here, select the relevant items, and click Remove. You can edit a rate plan settings or delete it entirely by clicking this icon and selecting Edit or Delete. If you prefer, temporarily deactivate the rate plan simply by turning this toggle off. Once deactivated, guests will not be able to make reservations under this rate plan. Additional rate plans can be created at any time by clicking New Rate Plan. 
If you have any questions or feedback, click the question mark widget in the Guestie dashboard to contact us or to view more in our Help Center. Thanks for watching.